We begin tonight with a scathing new allegation from New Jersey's Congresswoman Mikey Sherrill. In a 13-minute long Facebook Live address, Sherrill says she witnessed unidentified Congress members leading groups of visitors through the Capitol the day before the violent pro-Trump mob attacked the building. Sherrill described what she saw as a reconnaissance for the next day and is spearheading over 30 members of Congress in requesting an investigation into the suspicious activity at the Capitol complex. It may have enabled the attack that led to five deaths. Cheryl described the tours on January 5th as, quote, a noticeable and concerning departure from the procedures in place as of March 2020, limiting the number of visitors to the Capitol. So concerning, they were reported to the sergeant at arms that day. Cheryl first revealed the allegation as part of her explanation for supporting a resolution urging Vice President Pence to invoke the 25th Amendment for Trump's incitement of the insurrection. So not only do I intend to see that the president is removed and never runs for office again and doesn't have access to classified material, I also intend to see that those members of Congress who embedded him, those members of Congress who had groups coming through the Capitol that I saw on January 5th, a reconnaissance for the next day, those members of Congress that incited this violent crowd, those members of Congress that attempted to help our president, undermine our democracy. I'm going to see that they're held accountable and if necessary, ensure that they don't serve in Congress.